Welcome to Watch Cards Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockiner. Today's story is attackers targeting ERP systems. If you haven't heard of an ERP system, it stands for Enterprise Resource Planning. And it's a special type of software that basically allows you to manage all your enterprise's information. For instance, they might allow you to aggregate data from your financing and accounting systems, your CRM system, uh, your manual systems like Excel spreadsheets. Basically, any different information you use to manage your business may all be managed in these ERP systems. Some common examples include the Oracle Enterprise Manager products and SAP products as well. In any case, today the Department of Homeland Security and U.S. CERT released some uh, advisories warning that cyber criminals seem to be specifically targeting ERP systems. And really this comes from a report from two companies, one called Digital Shadows and the other called Onapsis. In any case, this report talks about how they're seeing increased attacks against ERP systems. For the most part, it seems like cyber criminals are starting to focus on exploits and attacks that specifically target these type of systems. And it would make sense because an enterprise that uses them really has a lot of their most important data in these systems. The report also goes on to say that even crypto miners have started to exploit these systems to use them as a resource to mine cryptocurrency. Anyways, I'm just bringing this up for any organizations out there that do use ERP systems. I suspect smaller businesses is done, but if you're a medium-sized business or an enterprise, you probably have an ERP system somewhere in your organization. And really, the things you can do to protect it are first, make sure to patch this system aggressively. Uh, these attackers often exploit uh, vulnerabilities against these systems which have been fixed long ago. You should also harden these systems, make sure that they're not network accessible except for when you really want them to be. And finally, make sure to uh, apply really good role-based access control of these systems and limit privileges. That means only give full access to users that absolutely need it for their job uh, and only give individual users access to the specific types of data that they need on these systems. So anyway, if you're interested in more information about uh, these criminals targeting ERP systems, uh, be sure to have links to the report uh, in the blog post associated with this video. That's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.